In 14 hours, the polls will open for the midterm election, and we have seen record-setting early voter turnout all across the state. KVU political reporter Ashley Godot is here. And Ashley, while people are talking about the big Senate race here in Texas, political insiders are really watching the House. Mike and Terry, historically, the balance of power in Congress flips during a president's first midterm election, but chances are Republicans will maintain control of the Senate. Yes, we have one of the hottest Senate races in the country happening right here in Texas, but even if it were to flip, that's just one seat. So let's dive into the numbers here just a little bit. So of the 100 members of the U.S. Senate, 35 of them are up for re-election. Of those 35, 27 seats are currently held by Democrats and just eight are held by Republicans. So Democrats would have to keep all 27 of their seats in the Senate and gain two additional seats in order for them to take control. Political forecasters at 538 calculate there's only a one in six chance of that happening. But there's a much different story if we walk over here to the House. All 435 members of the House of Representatives are up for re-election. Currently, there are 240 Republicans and 195 Democrats. Now, Democrats need to gain just 23 seats to take control of the House. And the same analysts predict there's a 7 in 8 chance of that happening. Now, tonight at 6, I'll show you which Texas district's experts say could flip. And remember, the polls are open tomorrow from 7 a.m. until 7 p.m. To find out where to vote and for information on the candidates, check out our voter guide at kvu.com slash vote Texas.